And as the price of IBM was going up today, that option, that call option was going down. And it, it, it ended up stopping out because it, then it did pull back enough to hit my stop loss. But mm -hmm. just curious, why does that happen? Like on a call, price is going up. Like it was up a buck and a half and I'm down, I don't know, I was down like 30 bucks today, just today alone on that call option. And I couldn't figure out what the heck. Like I checked it eight times to see if I didn't accidentally buy a put because I've done that before. But no, it was actually a call, but it was going down with the price going up. I couldn't figure out why. Sean, I remember you buying that thing for six dollars and two cents. Um, I'm just now seeing your text message too, um, and it was five dollars and forty cents when you text me. Um, I I believe what happened was the implied volatility was a factor as well. Um, you saw VIX also started to come down quite a bit today, and there was a one point where I saw VIX was coming down with the S and P index coming down as well at the same time. So uh, the, the implied volatility was definitely a huge factor. Um, the fear definitely increases the value of certain premiums, and that could have been the issue for you, Sean. Uh, yeah. I just think that the implied volatility fluctuated on the contract.